I'm Elisabeth Isaac, a singer-songwriter, um, originally from the Arctic, Canada, and I've been living in Montreal for the last 11 years now. And I first um, started singing um, with my uncles. They formed the band in the 60s, and he asked me to be their back vocalist when I was quite what young, 15 years old. So that's where I really started um, to want to make music and then when I was around, I don't know, 18, 19, I started writing my first songs. When I did my first album uh, about seven years ago, it was really um, interesting because I felt like there was not a lot of uh, um, a native uh, music in Montreal and native music in the sense where where we sing aside from French or English and I really felt really privileged to be having that spot you know for me and making modern music also and, and now since the last years I think three four five years it's been just so eclectic I find um, Montreal is really um, is really opening up and it's it kind of exploding with really amazing sound. Montrealers are truly die-hard Arcade Fire band. I mean, our band, when we're touring in this very um, big province of Quebec, because we get to tour hours and hours of driving, and we just listen to Arcade Fire. I mean, we're just a bit obsessed, and we, it's like we can't get over it. It's just a very unique band, and I think they're very inspiring. We've been touring for a little over a year now, and we've done, what, almost 100 sh shows now? And then New York has just been great because we've been coming here since January, and we're coming back in June for my album release in the States. So it's called There Will Be Stars, too, because I just thought it was a really nice uh, cultural uh, message because uh, Inuit people were living in this you know, no trees in the tundra and very harsh environment. And my grandfather always had to look at the stars in order to orient himself when he got lost in the, in the snowstorm or whatever. So for us, the stars are very important and it's just to be able to say that we have to just look beyond this but realize that the universe is it's, it's huge. Yeah, I may be from the Arctic, but I know of Pac-Man. I mean, winters are long, you know, up north. So this saves you from going insane.